Hello, welcome to Bentley's Backwards Bushcraft, and this is Richard. So I have a tribute video. This is a tribute to the now defunct channel that I am not saying. <laughs> anyway, I uh, went to the Dollar Tree, got a few things. Uh, this may be one video, it may be two videos, I don't know. Uh, I have enough for two videos but it's only about 30 items. So anyway, uh, we are going to get to just the random slash outdoorsy survival items that I've got. <clears throat> uh, I purchased uh, two of the epoxy super glues. Uh, uh, I love using primitive uh, glue and I love making it, but when you have the ability to use this, you might as well use it when you can. <clears throat> Let's see here. Uh, Frosty the Snowman Gummies. Little candies. Now these have no survival uh, application whatsoever. They're just going to taste good. Uh, Let's see here. We have a tin Danish style butter cookies. Again, I love these cookies, but this tin is going to make a char tin. It's going to make a tin to make char out of. That's what I told myself when I purchased it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this item has no survival skills uh, applicable use. Well, I'm sure it does at some point, but it's, it's just a dollar movie. It's called Werewolves of the Third Reich. <laughs> <laughs> Nazi werewolves. Anyway, uh, I, I just love crazy, stupid movies. All right, so uh, I am actually kind of tired of not having a strainer that I can use for my tree sap, my, my pine sap, and things to that nature. So I purchased uh, this pack, this two-pack mesh strainer that actually goes on a sink. Uh, for that purpose and uh, I also use these particular ones especially the small one to filter water when I'm putting it into uh, a small drinking container that way the leaves and, and big bugs and stuff like that act, it can filter that out in a little bit but anyway uh, I could also use it for my tree sap and I got a bigger one here because I'm just I, I've been needing these little mesh strainers three or four times for some projects and I just don't have them laying around. Now I know that I have these somewhere in my stash in in a box somewhere but I don't have them out and available so I'm gonna spend two I'm gonna spend two dollars instead of spending and two or three hours trying to find one and there we go. Now these last two things are going to be glue at some point. Some uh, two rawhide roll dog treats. And eventually this is going to go with the other rawhide pieces that I purchased uh, three or four days ago or so. And uh, I'll soak these in water until they get soft then I will boil them and we're going to make glue out of these eventually. So anyway that's it for... Uh, oh wait wait one more thing here. Uh, now these did not come from the Dollar Tree. These actually came from uh, Meyer, only because I haven't found them at the Dollar Tree yet. But I did spend two dollars a piece on these instead of one dollar. I got five graphite rods. And if you guys are following my channel, you know why I've purchased these. These are going to become atlatl arrows or arrows for my bow one or the other and maybe eventually both so there we go so that is uh, that haul right there and we will call this one quits I got to change the battery and then I have one more haul from the Dollar Tree that I want to do thank you for watching Bentley's Backwoods Bushcraft and enjoy the outdoors even if it's just your own backyard <laughs>